Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Shining Force 2. Today we um, we fight the first of three battles, three boss battles in a row. First off though, uh, I have a little detour to make, because the boss is up north here. We are going down south. There's still stuff to explore. Well, explore kind of. I just want to show you something. Well, a few things, actually. It's not necessary to do what I'm doing right now. This is why it's called a detour. Um, well, sometimes detours are necessary, but that's something else. Uh, we are coming in a um, tunnel here. And I said tunnel, yes. You, prob you can probably guess what I'm talking about if I say tunnel. It's a this whole place here. It has the tranquil, tranquil music of the ruins. And here it's kind of weird. Here it gets a little weird. What can I do? And then teleportation! And we end up in, eventually, in more weird places. I don't know where this is. Subspace, no doubt. Doesn't matter. Oh, by the way, all these things here don't work. Because these are the ancient tunnels. Oh my god, we heard of that. Whoa, there's a golem here. We heard of them a long time ago, uh, back on South Burmesia, when we were hearing about Petro. Actually, you just you were just reminded of that yesterday uh, with my flashback thing. So all these don't work. The only one that works is the Parmesia one, which is down here to the left, this one here. I'm not gonna get on it just yet, I wanna check out that golem. And yeah, the Grand Swan, which we came from. So, that golem here, hello. Simplet put the arm of golem on the golem. Exactly, that is exactly why you picked up the arm of golem. Oh, 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 oh my god, I'm heavy. That feels good. My power is back. Yeah, you totally need your arm to survive, of course. I can move again. How can I express? Oh, yes. I'll join you. I'll protect you. It's a golem. It's a giant rock that moves. A pun bunch of rocks, actually. And it's going to protect me. So Claude is a golem, very obviously. Very strangely as well. It's a fully promoted one, so he doesn't promote into anything else. Not use. I'm a silly member. Let's check him out. So, Claude, you know what? The best way to check him out is in the machine. Let's go there. To get to the machine, we need to go out. So let's go back to Parmesia. See if anything has changed. Hint, hint, something did. I'm gonna show you once we get there. Not everything. Most things stayed pretty much the same. Alright, so yeah, you remember this place? There's no door here anymore. I don't know why. It disappeared uh, midway through the game. I'm not sure what happened to it. So, outside... No, wait. I'm not outside yet. So, outside here, first off, let's get the machine off of the cave and check out Claude, because he's in the team with everyone else. Whoops. I need to hit Purge to check him out. Who leaves the battle party? So here you have your whole battle party. So you have Zinc, level 16, with these stats. And then you have Claude, who has these stats. 70 defense is the most, I'm pretty sure. 60, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's the highest defense, of course. Of course, he has only 45 HP. That's not nearly enough. <laughs> he's... Okay, I'm gonna tell you. He's basically like... Um, like uh, Leo, except he has way more defense, way more attack, and way more HP than Leo ever will at, at his level. Only he has four movements, so Leo is um, the faster, the faster super tank, while this is the slow but more powerful super tank. And I'm gonna take this one. Yeah, he has only four movement, but we have things against that. I know I'm out of running Pimento, but Tyron has a running ring which he's not using. Also, you might have noticed when I just did that very temporarily, he's level 14. He's way behind. Giant was level 14 when he, um, yeah, I changed my mind. Giant was level 14 when he joined us and um, uh, that was two battles ago. A, a good two battles ago. 
So, um, yeah, way behind in levels. However, the the next battle is a godsend as far as having people uh, catch up in levels goes. So, um, should be fine. You'll see. You'll see. We're about to go there anyway. So, equip this, and yeah. Both very powerful characters, but very slow, are now a reasonable six movements. So it's gonna be fine. Also, I am sailing to my next destination. Ah, maybe I should cut. Then again, it's not gonna take that much time. It's just a little bit. If I trigger a battle, it's going to take way longer though. So if that happens, it then okay, I'm fine. Two things I want to check out. Okay, I am going to cut once I after I've checked the first one. First one is right around. Oh wait, no, third. Yeah, there's three things I want to check out. Two of them are really close though. The first one is this. Hey dwarves, how's it going? Are they gone? Yeah, they are. Yeah, they've dug their tunnel. I'm still blocked. I can't go to Grant's through there. That's fine. I got the ancient tunnels now. I don't need your tunnel anymore, silly dwarves. Pfft. <laughs> I wonder if I'm gonna see them again. I wonder. Let's keep going. Oh, and by the way, when I say dwarves, I mean, of course, monkeys. Of course. They so look like monkeys. Next up, I wanted to just show you very, really quickly, without actually doing anything about it, uh, this thing in here, which I'm going to show you. Hold on a second. I'm just going to get to it. I talked about it last time I was here, but that was way long ago, so I'm just going to get over there. It's going to be a better way to show you what I'm talking about. Actually, I don't know. I don't need to go down south, but I'm doing it anyways. Uh, if you go, if exit, if you exit to the right, you get to welcome to the fairy woods special stage. How quickly can you defeat all the hidden monsters? Now, set a new record. Best record so far is very long. Are you ready? Uh, sure, set, go. I'm gonna ha be the fastest because I am going to um, leave. The point here is not to be fast, by the way. There is, uh, you can see the map, there's no one. There's only one uh, way up top. It's the most useless enemy ever. It's a bubbling ooze. You have to kill that to end the battle. However, there's going to be plenty of things that are going to spawn in your way. Also, you have to go left and then the path kind of... Hold on. The path kind of follows this. You go up and then left some and up and you know, and then you follow this like this, and then you go up and you get here because there's bushes hidden under the undergrowth. It's really annoying, it's not straightforward. Also, you could not do that last time you were here because around here spawns a mist demon and you can't really beat something that has a hundred plus attack back when you just promoted. No, you can't. So yeah, this is solely for when you come back here, and it is pretty much your best way of grinding up people that are way behind in levels. Um, and by that I mean like, I don't know, if I ever wanted to play Leo again, I could come back here and grind him up some, because there's creatures of all the walks of levels, you know? Instead of, oh my god, I spawned back here. That's terrible, I have to walk way back because there's something else I want to show you. I should have shown that on the way back. I didn't think of egress. Well, I'm going to cut and um, I'll see you at the next place I wanted to go. See you all. Alright, we're almost where I'm going. Yeah, that's right, I'm going to see Creed. Let's check up on Odai and stuff, but before we do that, I forgot we were hoarding, and by we I mean I, obviously, was hoarding another item, which I'm trying to find, well, cheerful bread, first off, which is gonna help poor uh, Claude with his dreadful HP. Raised by four, yay, he's 50 HP now. Um, the other thing I was hoarding is the Brave Apple. Whoa, I was using and not passing. I was close to... HP 2, Attack 2, Defense 3, Agility 1. He gains a lot of stats, like Zinc. Mostly defense, but a lot of stats, period. Alright, uh... What is this? 
This is new. This doesn't... Whoa. There's lots of people here. Goliath, what's happened? <laughs> what's his voice? <laughs> oh, simple it. Adler regained his memory and suddenly went berserk. He had a fearful face, but my master seemed to understand everything. He fell into the sea to stop Adler. Is Mr. Creed still alive? I have no idea. So, he took Adler and threw himself into the sea. Kind of like Sherlock Holmes in the new movie. So, I really want to find the legendary magic sword, but I can't do that if I'm stuck here. May I join your force? Sure, why not? <laughs> ah, and we get every Kree character in the game. We actually recruit out of them, so you could technically use that battle I just showed you to grind all of them way up to have all four of the ultimate classes of everything, but really I hate grinding, so screw that. Also, if you are going to grind, better take one of the two physical classes because magic uh, users are very easy to grind compared to physical classes who really rely on their very low stats, you know what I mean? So um, yeah, just keep that in mind. I was surprised to find I had returned to my original size. You were also surprised to see how small you really are anyways, I'm sure. What should I do now? I can go anywhere, maybe huh. with you? Oh sure. If you want to hang out in the caravan, that's fine with me. Because <laughs> he's going to stay there. Oh yeah, no way I'm grinding you up to par. Because yeah, they're still level 24 unpromoted, of course. Of course they didn't train while, I, uh, while you were gone. I'm free! free. Fresh hair smells so good! Yeah, smell can ruin also, I'm so, I suppose. Where should I go? Hey, may I go with you? Sure, this is the best priest in the game as far as balance goes. Freya is still the most powerful one, just because he masters he uh, Aura. He does not master heal at all. He masters Aura. And I, I have the longest retinue I'm ever going to get in this game. Also, I was just checking out to see if Fairy was there. Doesn't look like it. Uh, apparently there's books there, but the centaur does not... Wait, no. I can't go there. Why couldn't I go there? I don't understand. So yeah, anyways. That happened. Creed and Adler are dead, or missing in sea, somehow. That happened. It's a bit sad, but what can you do? We won't get to... oh. That is perfect. You know why? I was gonna go back to that training facility back in the elven town, because this is a shortcut back to the main... not the mainland, or on the mainland. Back to our island. Yeah. Then we can just go on and fight that next battle, which, like I said, is the first of three boss battles in a row. Lots of fun coming up, I'm telling you. I am telling you. Alright, so this happens here. Ba -da 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 -da. No, holy! <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh my god, you see that? That's flowers. Those flowers were not just a cutscene thing, by the way. You're actually gonna find them. Also, take note of where they're facing right now. Just trust me. Darn you, Grandfield Swine. You're here early, but don't worry. I just finished my preparations. Yes, everything's ready. It's showtime. Oh yeah. Sir Astral, why is he smiling? He believes this is the place where we will die. Oh my god, he's confident, I suppose. Simple, be careful. Oh sure, I shall be. So, um, this battle is hard, I'm telling you right now. This is one of the hard battles as uh, defined by my definition I gave of it, which is one of those battles where when I wasn't thinking too much about what I was doing, I could stay stuck on. And this is one of them. In fact, if I think about it, there's about five of them. And of those five, this is probably... Okay, Zalbird's probably the least hard of the five, and this is probably the second least hard, so the fourth, right? There's, it's in the top five, not in the top three. This is Albert. <sighs> yeah, it's hard. Um, so there's new stuff, not a lot. 
Let's just check out the map. Oh yeah. Hey, it's go it goes in the diagonal and there's a giant line of enemies there to stop us. Um not new enemies though. There's the flowers, which are the actual boss. Prism flowers. They have twenty attack. How pathetic is that? Well not really, because they ignore defense. Yeah, it's gonna do twenty no matter what.